Welcome back. In this video, we want to talk about using Discovery Ed resources and posting them on Google Classroom. So in Discovery, the best thing to do is find a resource and add it to your content. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's say I'm searching for something on volcanoes. Once I have my search results, I'll look for something that we can use as an example. Let's take this video segment right here, four minutes and 14 seconds. If you click the plus sign, it'll add it to your quick list. And your quick list is up here at the top. So right here, the quick list shows that I have 24 different items in my quick list already. You can add it to your quick list, that's one way. Or if you wanna be more organized, you can click this more actions button. And what you can do is add to my content. So let's do that. When this window pops open, it's gonna ask you where you wanna save this content. So you can create a new folder if you'd like to, or use an existing one you've already created. In this case, I'm just gonna click add. It's a good idea to store things in my content so that you know that you have them saved for later and you can keep them organized. Remember which clips you used for certain lessons. So I'm gonna go back now to the home page by clicking the discovery icon on the left-hand side. Now I'm gonna to go to my content by clicking here. Now in my content, I can see the volcano video I just added right here at the bottom, and it tells me the date it was created. So to share this with Google Classroom, what you wanna do is click on actions, click on share. Your sharing options right here, you have Google Classroom on the left-hand side, here's the symbol, click that. Next, you're gonna pick the class that you'd like this to be shared with, and you can click this down arrow right here, and I'm gonna click this example period three science class. Next, you wanna choose an action, and this will give you the same options that you have in Google Classroom. So I'm gonna create an assignment. I'm gonna hit go. And now notice, I'm gonna expand this, but notice that you have the same options here as in Google Classroom. It basically opens up the Google Classroom page. Now I can title this assignment and say volcano video. I can give some directions here. And over here, again, I have options just like I would in Google Classroom. I can assign a point value, or I can say that this is an ungraded assignment. I just want them to watch it. You can set the due date. You can select the topic. So all the same actions that you would have normally in Google Classroom when you create an assignment. And then up at the top here, I would just click Assign. Once you've clicked Assign, I can go down here to the lower right-hand corner and click View. And that will take me to my classroom. I can see this assignment now posted there. If I want to look closer at that assignment, I could go up here to the Classwork tab. And you can see it right here. I'm gonna click on volcano video and you can see my assignment here. If I click on it, it will take me to the volcano video. So there you go. There's the steps you need to take to take any of those resources from Discovery Education and then post them as an assignment in Google Classroom. If you have any questions, please contact me at kbullendorf at fleetwoodasd.org. Until next time, have a great day.